This is an absolutely crazy water shader in Blender 3. So this water shader is available on Gumroad. All the other jazz around it is um, Sketchfab assets. So there'll be a link in the description for them as well. Uh, no affiliate links. But let's kind of go through the base scene of the water shader. Some cool things we can do in here. We can even change the color from this green. Let's go to maybe like a deep ocean color or an algae green. We know a few swimming pools that look like this. So this is the basic scene just by itself. All I've got is the Nasagi shader, the sky texture shader. So if we go into world, I can quickly show you. This is all it is, a sky texture. No lamps, no nothing. And this is the jazz that we've got. I don't know what I'm doing. But here we can see that we've got a very deep kind of like ocean depth. But if you want it shallower, we can go the water density down to about 150. Let's press enter on that. And you can see that the water becomes quite shallow. Now we'll jump over into the other scene. Let's just have a quick look at this one and we'll do the same thing over here. And so I've zoomed right in. If we kind of want to make that water a little bit clearer, we can go with the Corsix there down to 50. So you can see that, uh, sorry, the water density there. We can see that the light's coming through a lot more. We've got some wonderful little fish in there. However, there is a slight issue. So just be aware. Um, the Corsic brightness, the value should be one by default. Okay, so that's what it should be. Um, but you can see that it's kind of like, yeah, you don't see as much. So if you bump it up to five, it looks a lot better. However, around the edges there, it kind of almost brightens up. So that's just something to be wary of. Let's make those ripples sizes. Uh, let's bump it down to maybe five to really make them a little bit bigger. So it all depends on the scale of your scene and how you want to do it. Ripple variation, I mean, we can, that's just kind of like a seed number. Um, we can come down here and once again, we can change the color of the scene. So we can have like the dark radioactive green. Um, ooh, that looks like Lake Burley Griffin. We know a few water sources like this. <laughs> So this is all in Blender 3 as well. Um, so yeah, there is a link in the description if you want to pick this up. Um, if you like these videos, hey, leave a comment. Let me know. Let me know if you want me to keep finding these resources. Um, and also, Unreal Engine 5 might be coming up soon.